The beat of a drum, a song in their hearts, and the power of prayer turns the chapel into the epicenter for Catholics celebrating Black History Month. All of us, you know, no matter what the color of our skin may be, we're striving to be disciples. We're striving to be witnesses of, of the risen Lord. Brooklyn Auxiliary Bishop Neil Tiedemann presides at the vibrant liturgy. It's so special to think that people come together celebrating their roots, the history, coming to understand who we are. The more we come together and collaborate, the more we are church together. The annual mass is a collaboration between the Brooklyn and Rockville Center dioceses. Auxiliary Bishop Guy Sanserique of Brooklyn, Auxiliary Bishop Andres of Long Island, priests and worshipers from the two Catholic districts gather at the Immaculate Conception Center. <laughs> Also in attendance, the homilist, Bishop Joseph Perry. Chicago's Vicar General says the national observance is a time to highlight the rich culture. It's a way in which African Americans or people of African descent can uh, bring together the accomplishments of people of African descent that make up this great United States of America. Such as the achievement of Father Augustus Tolton, the first African priest to minister in the U.S. Bishop Perry leads the campaign to canonize the 19th century cleric. And mass goers I spoke with say this gathering makes them proud to celebrate their Catholic faith and their heritage. It is so beautiful, all of us coming together with one purpose, to love one another and to praise the Lord. I enjoy it, that we come together. It makes me feel really proud of who I am as a black woman. It's a time for all of these proud black Catholics to share their traditions and their faith. Reporting for Currents from Douglaston, I'm Tim Harfman.